Good day to all my students. Last time, I shared to you the overview and the definitions of engineering drawing and its application. Today, I will share to you the module two of engineering drawing. Okay, once again, I'm Engineer Manager Mandana, your course professor in Engineering Drawing. Today, I will discuss to you the Module 2 of engineering, of engineering Drawing. The title of our topic for today is Engineering Lettering. So, ngayon, malalaman ninyo kung ano nga ba yung mga techniques or ano ba ang lettering na appropriate for our Engineering Drawing. So, our motivational code for today, Ecclesiastes 12.1. Remember also your creator in the days of your youth before the evil days come and the years draw near of which you will say, I have no pleasure in it. So have a blessed day today and I will discuss to you the engineering lettering. In this discussion, you will be able to learn the engineering lettering and I will share to you the instruction of individual output. One. Okay, ngayon pa lang kayo gagawa ng individual output. So, mag-drawing na talaga kayo. Okay? So, for the objectives, you will write uh, letters according to standard and I will explain to you the different line types. For, for our uh, activity, just to have some fun, uh, I will give to you the four picks and one word game. So, katulad ng last topic natin, uh, meron din akong uh, shinare, okay? Para sa uh, para sa para sa nakaraan na ating four picks and one word game, the correct answer is engineers. Okay? Engineers po yung last time natin na uh, four picks and one word game. And today, the four picks and one word game. Ito na yun. So, as you can see, meron ditong um, may mga gears sa kanyang utak. Uh, ito, nag-iisip siya. Okay? Nag-iisip din dito sa baba. And dito, yan, may dinadrawing na siya. So, ano kaya yan? Okay? So, in every, in, in some pages, nandoon yung clue natin. Okay? So, take down notes, all the clue. And malalaman ninyo kung ano ang um, four picks and one word game na yan. And that's uh, the final instruction we'll, be, we'll give to at the end of the module. Okay? Okay, so last time, uh, nagkaroon kayo ng activity. Okay? And this activity, ay isi-share ko sa inyo yung key to correction. So, in every app, so yung next module, nandoon lagi ang key to correction. So, ano yung game natin, yung activity 1 natin? So, balikan lang natin. Ito yung activity natin. So, uh, this activity aims to review your lesson. So, answer the following question and send your answer to your professor uh, via Facebook Messenger. And, yun nga, you will find out the correct answer in the next module. So, ito yung mga question natin. Yung unang question is, who am I? Sino daw siya? I am using the dividing curve and straight lines into any number of equal parts. So, ano kaya yan? Okay? The correct answer is, Divider. Okay? Divider lang ang sagot. Divider lang ang sagot. Yun, yung lang, yun lang yung nasa clue. So, divider. So, yan yan. One point. Okay? For number two, what is my purpose? So, tingnan ninyo ha. What is my purpose? So, dal isa. Ito, what is my purpose? Ang, yan yung question niya. Then, meron pa siyang definition dito. I am in flat piece of plastic containing various cut-out shapes. So, yan yung nakakalito dyan. Ano ba talaga ang question ni Madam? So, actually, dalawa ang question dyan. Ano yung purpose nitong uh, clue na nandito? Okay? So, the answer is template. Okay? And, ano yung purpose niya? Designed to speed the work of the drafter and to make the finished drawing more accurate. 
Okay, so number three, what I am made up of. Okay, I am an important device to protect lines near being erased. So, ano siya? So, that is eraser, sh eraser. <laughs> eraser shield. It is made up of thin metal plate. So, mapapansin ninyo anong ano siya, made up of. Okay, yun yung nakalagay. What I am made up of. So, thin, thin metal plate. That is eraser shield. So, number four. Question number four. What is my use? I am two legs pivoted at the top. Ano daw ang use niya? So, number four, it is compass. Used to draw circles and arcs both in pencil and ink. Okay, number five. How will you apply me? Can you give at least one? I am an essential part of almost all engineering projects. So, ano siya? That is engineering drawing. Ah, engineering drawing. At ang sagot, sabi doon, at least one. Okay, at least one. So, ang sagot dyan, either of these four. Dapat either of these four to. Okay? It is made in ships for navigation, for manufacture of machines, automobiles, etc. For construction of buildings, roads, Bridges, dams, electrical and telecommunication structures, etc. For manufacturing of electric appliances like TV, phone, computers, etc. And number six, what is my importance? I am defined as graphical language used by engineers and other technical personnel. So, ano siya? Okay, so engineering drawing ulit. It is communication, discussion, re records. Okay, kahit alin sa tatlo. Number seven. What type am I belong? I am used for pencil work. Seven is paper type. And ano daw yung ano niya? Uh, what type am I belong? Okay, so sa detail paper siya. Okay, kahit pagbalik tarin mo to, itong detail paper tapos ito yung mauna tapos sunod yung paper type, okay lang. Walang problema dyan. And eight, number eight is which is better? I am used for borderline but I don't know if which is better size for me. So, number 8 is pencil and 2H, 3H. Either of 2 or both. Correct yan. Kung 2H, 3H, okay lang. Pag 2H lang, okay lang. Pag 3H, okay lang. But other than that, it's wrong. Okay? 9 or 10? 9 to 10. What are my types? Give 2. I am used by engineers and technical personnel for their plans and designs. So, engineering drawing ulit and kahit alin dito sa apat okay kahit alin dito sa apat mechanical engineering drawing geometrical drawing civil engineering drawing and electrical engineering drawing pero dapat dalawa so kung ME and geometrical drawing so correct pag civil and electrical correct kung mechanical civil or either kung magkabaralanggado ba kayan so it's okay Okay, so plus two points for the honesty and integrity. So reminder, the Lord detests dishonest scales, but accurate weights find favor with Him. Proverbs 11.1. 1. So may reminder pa ko dyan, ha. So kailangan magkaroon ng honesty and integrity.